Hey gang, it's the uh, 1806 game. We're playing Rossbox uh, Avenge, Avenged, and uh, we're doing the afternoon turn of the 11th, so things are kind of moving slowly. I'm only playing a little bit every other day or so. <clears throat> Starting to get into a few more combats now, and here's one of the interesting situations. Uh, there were... this force was... I don't know, here, and these guys were here. And uh, we had a uh, a um, combat, and so we rolled an exchange, which meant that this force here would have been eliminated, Zezewicz would have been eliminated. Uh, but because of the way that the uh, reorganization eligibility rules work, even if you're eliminated, if you are eligible to retreat, uh, you are able to do so. And so because an exchange is defined as an elimination, uh, these guys would be eligible to retreat because there's a hex open, so they can retreat one hex. Uh, the other thing here is that these guys would have been eliminated under the exchange because there's uh, the 18 factors here and 6 here. We rolled four to, had a 4 to 1 and we rolled a 6. So these guys can retreat to here. This is a uh, vedette, so uh, it's zone of control. It doesn't have a zone of control. And in, in a, uh, retreats we can we can do that type of thing so he's okay as well uh, let's see so we go over to this side of the board and uh, so those uh, so those uh, forces here uh, Lagrand and Laval attack Mila and got the videttes behind them to try and uh, block the retreat up the road nevertheless with a defender eliminated they're retreating to the woods and across the stream and I believe that we can do that across the stream. I have to check that. But uh, once again, that would mean um, no elimination. And maybe it's the scale, but I find that kind of unusual that uh, in, what, in essence what this means, unless you're completely surrounded, you're not going to be permanently eliminated. Uh, you may well end up uh, either being able to retreat like this or end up on the reorganization table, which I understand is uh, you know, a metaphor for the forces breaking up and running away and then kind of being rallied and reformed. But this seems uh, to be, to me, not in the form or function of the how things worked historically back then. My understanding is that we had uh, very linear lines of battle and even at uh, at this kind of zoomed out scale, I think we're one mile a hex, right? Uh, these uh, encirclements are the only way that you can destroy units. So we'll keep playing and see how this all kind of pans out. I'm enjoying the game. It's really interesting. There's nice uh, some nice flavor and tactical choices to be made and the maps are beautiful and the counters are good and uh you know we're trying to i kind of feel like i'm playing uh, a victory lost in that we have a very spartan german force i.e the prussians against the juggernaut uh russians but in this case it's the french uh, who are just bringing on uh, core after core and uh, are going to get to where they want to get to it's just a matter of how long it takes and uh, how much time the Prussians can buy against the French. So it's interesting uh, experience at the moment and we'll continue on and see what happens from here.